Each presidential candidate should focus on his own campaign and should stop trying to get the competition to step aside, businessman George Go said on Wednesday. Mr Go was referring to fellow hopeful and former MTUC income, Chief Tan Kin Lian, who has made repeated calls for one of them to give way to support the other non-establishment candidate should both men qualify to run. Nobody should tell anybody to step down. This should not be the way, said Mr Go, 63, during a visit to Bukit Penjang Hawker Centre and Market. He added, I want to make it very clear, focus on your campaign, alright? Let the voters make the decision. Who will be the right candidate to be in the Istana? Meanwhile, Mr Tan, 75, reiterated that he did not think that both him and Mr Go would be deemed eligible to run, but if that happens he would try to discuss the matter with Mr Go because I don't want the independent candidate's vote to be split. Mr Go said that, as far as he is concerned, he is the only one who is truly independent and furthest away from the establishment or any political party as the sole candidate seeking to qualify through his private sector experience. Mr Go was also asked about an interview that fellow presidential candidate in Kok Song, 75, did with Nanyang Technological University academic Walid Jamblat on Tuesday. Mr Ng, a former GIC chief investment officer, had said he hoped to be the middle ground choice and acknowledged that he may garner votes that could otherwise go to Mr Go or former senior minister Thaman Shanmugaram. 66, responding, Mr Go said he was not concerned about the splitting of any votes and any candidate who enters the race talking about splitting votes should be written off by voters as he is not competent. If you're coming for this election, why is your mind thinking of splitting the vote? You should say, I should win the election, this should be the right way, he said. So I will tell the voter, remove this candidate immediately in your mind. Mr Go also addressed Mr Tan's comments that the presidential election is very rushed. He said, please don't complain anymore, go and prepare all your campaign materials. What are you representing? What are you going to tell the voters? Don't do that complain anymore, you are not going to do any justice to anybody. Mr Tan, who was on a separate walkabout at Tanjong Pega Market and Food Center on Wednesday, said he is only asking that Mr Go be open to consider avoiding splitting votes. He first mooted the idea of meeting and discussing with Mr Go on who should step down if both qualify at the launch of his presidential bid on Friday. Mr Tai noted that Mr Go had responded to his overtures on Tuesday with a Chinese idiom that means going off into flights of fancy. I still respect Mr Go, no matter what he says. And I think it's better that we should be more cordial, he said. We should be talking to each other. We should not be arrogant. Mr Tang stressed that he did not think that all four candidates would be found eligible to run, and that he remained adamant that either himself or Mr Go should step down if both of them receive certificates of eligibility from the Presidential Elections Committee. If I have to, I'll go and meet Mr Go and talk for three hours at any place, said Mr Tang. But Mr Go expressed no interest in such a discussion. The businessman said he should focus on his campaign. Don't lose the deposit is most important, right? Make sure don't lose the deposit and make sure cross 5% of the votes.